Hi, I'm Will, a car journalist, and I'm here to reveal Top Drive's next Tri-Series prize car. Here at Top Drive's, we love facts and figures. The bigger, the better, usually. Thousands of horsepower and torque, 250 plus miles per hour. But today is slightly different. We're here to talk about a single figure, one. To be exact, the Koenigsegg 1.1. Called that because for every one kilo it has, it has one horsepower to push it around. 1360 horsepower and 1360 kilos, which means it has a power to weight ratio of 1000 brake horsepower per tonne. That's astonishing, especially when you consider the Chiron Supersport has 1.2 kilos to every one horsepower it has, a 20% worse power to weight ratio. And the Chiron is hardly a slouch. As a result, the 1.1's performance is astonishing. It does not to 62 in 2.8 seconds. It does not 200 kilometers per hour in just over 6.6 .6 seconds. It holds all manner of world records as well. It does not to 200 miles per hour in just over 14 seconds, and then back from 200 miles per hour to north again in an eyeball worrying 6.3 seconds. How it achieves that performance is what's truly incredible. Thanks to Super Futura, the UK's official Koenigsegg dealer, we have a car here to poke around. And thanks to Zach's Garage for this fantastic location. So, let's go and take a closer look. The one-to-one -one is closely related to the Koenigsegg Agera R. They share the same 5-litre V8, but this has 220 more horsepower. It doesn't just get that through a simple software upgrade. Cams, valves, fuel pumps, everything's been changed. The result, 1360 horsepower, is one megawatt of power, which makes this the first official mega car. The one-to-one's body and chassis is also really similar to the Agera R. Every aspect has been rethought to make it more focused. The suspension has been completely retuned so it can cope with more downforce. The wings and splitters on the one-to-one -one produced 600 kilos at 280 kilometers per hour. When it comes to downforce, the rear wing is the star of the show. Not only is it top mounted with supports that extend right from the roof so that there's no disruption to the airflow, it works at different angles depending on different situations. It also acts as an air brake, but we're never fully stalling, so it always support when the car's braking. Even with things like carbon fibre springs, the suspension and aero on the one-to-one -one would add 30 kilograms to an Agera R. Not ideal in a car that already needed to be 80 kilograms lighter. Every aspect of this car has been rethought through, from the door handles to the inner skins of the bonnet and boot, just to make it lighter. Even the sound deadening has been removed and replaced with speaker-assisted noise cancelling system. It's a real honour to spend some time with this car. Getting to look around it, getting to see under the bonnet, getting to look inside of it. It's such an engineering marvel. And soon, you'll be able to compete for this car in an upcoming Tri-Series event on Top Drives. In the school. In the school.